Good morning, children. Praise the Lord. We meet again today. Stay happy and healthy in this new day. Before we start our activities, let us start the day with a meditation with God's word this morning. And today, let's continue our adventure to know God's creation from God's amazing creation book. And this morning, we will learn from the title, Peanut Butter and Jelly. Before we proceed, shall we start with a prayer? Thank you, Lord, for the new day. Now we are ready to listen to your words. May your Holy Spirit be within us to lead us and bless us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Our memory verse for today is from Philippians chapter 2, verses 14-15. It says, Become blameless and pure, children of God, so you will shine like stars in the universe. Children, it was the day after Christmas and Sharon and Bobby were wandering through a crowded mall when they stopped at the pet store. There, they spied something very unusual. In the tortoise cage were two tortoises joined together at the side of their stomach near their tails. Sharon and Bobby both the tortoises took them home and named them peanut butter and jelly because you can't have one without the other. Their plan was to have them separated if they could find a veterinarian to do it. The two tortoises spent about half of their lives with one on its back while the other trying to kick itself over. Bobby and Sharon routinely flip over the tortoises, carefully keeping track of the time one stayed on its back while the other was upright, and they searched for a veterinarian who would agree to operate on them so they could be separated. Finally, two Arizona veterinarians said yes. The surgery was a great success. Now, peanut butter and jelly aren't a sandwich anymore. In fact, they were a little confused when they discovered that they weren't joined anymore and that they could stand upright. They lived most of their lives a little tilted. Children, our lives can become a little tilted too. Sometimes we get used to living a bit lopsided. We get crooked by not always telling the truth or not being kind. But when we choose to be children of God, we can straighten out and shine like stars in the heavens. This is the end of our morning worship. Children, of course, Sharon and Bobby were overjoyed when they could help separate the two tortoises. And of course, the tortoises feel more comfortable because they can move independently, not join to one another. Children, like the two thirties, are there any of you who are also temporarily attached to things that don't make you feel comfortable? Maybe there are things that are not good that is binding you Maybe it's disobeying your parents, not telling the truth, or other things. If so, 
then you need someone who has to help you leave those bad things or habits. And the person be able to help you is Jesus. Only He can free you from those evil bonds. You just need to come to Him to ask Jesus to help you get away from all bad things or habits. May the Lord bless and protect all of the children on this wonderful day. Amen. The Bible tells